Hello, my name is Estevan Montoya with designadvance.net and I would like to thank you for watching this video and today I want to teach you about church websites. I believe that a church needs a website. You say, why is that? One, to represent Christ online. You see, just about every business that I know has a website. Now I understand the local church is not a business, but we still need to represent our churches online. In our day and age, when people look for something, they normally turn to the internet. They no longer go to a phone book. They no longer go to uh, the yellow pages. They'll go to Google. You, you know the phrase, uh, Google it. Um, they often turn there. So let me ask you this. What if people, uh, what will people find when they search for a church in your city? Are they going to find your church online? Having a church website helps you represent Christ online. Not only does having a church website help you represent Christ online, but you can spread the word of God. You know, Paul, whenever he went about starting churches, he went where the people were. Let me share this a thought with you. People these days are online, between Facebook, Twitter, and a whole bunch of other social media platforms. There are literally millions of people online. Let me ask you this question. How are you reaching them? They may never hear of your church unless you can be found online. You can use a church website to reach people with the gospel of Jesus Christ. Not only can you evangelize or help spread the word of God, but you could just simply inform people about your church. Since a lot of things are going online, so are church events. Understand this, that your website can be a place for you to post updates and events for visitors and members alike. You can have a, a list of things that are taking place at your church so that whenever a visitor is looking for a church in your area, they look and they might see an event and that might interest them to come to your church or whatever the case may be. But you can place information on a church website that makes it easy for visitors to find your church and to know what's going on when they get there. Don't keep your church a secret. And let me just say this. I want to help you make a church website. Again, my name is Estevan Montoya with designadvanced.net and I am an independent Baptist church planter. I was, by the grace of God, able to start a church from scratch. Often when we traveled to other churches, we would see um, their their websites, and to be honest, some of them really didn't look that good, and I, I understand God understands the heart, and he, man looks in the outward, and God looks in the heart. I understand those things, but let me say this. People aren't God. They can't see your intentions. And so, if they see a website that doesn't look like it has it together, they will assume that your church doesn't have it together. And so we want to help you with a church website. Currently, we make websites for independent Baptist churches only. We make them for churches that uh, stand on the King James Bible. Independent Baptists that stand on the King James Bible, they defend it, and that are not ecumenical. Uh, we believe in separation. We're independent Baptists. We stand on the Word of God, and we stand for the doctrines of the Word of God, even if it divides. And so, if you are not of that group, then um, without uh, apology, this is who we're going to serve, the independent Baptist churches. And if you are an independent Baptist, or maybe your ministry is under the authority of an independent Baptist church, then we want to help you. So, let me go ahead and share with you a little bit about how we can help you with the church website. You need a church website, bottom line. What will you get if you choose to have help have us make a church website for you? Well, one, you'll get a complete church website. And let me say this, that this church website is managed through a program called WordPress. There's no additional charge for that. And we will place it on your server and we will get your church website installed. You'll get 10 gigabytes of web space. And that is plenty of web space to host a general church website. Now, if you decide to place sermons on there, um, don't worry about that. We can help you get your sermons online. This is just a starting point. Uh, we don't want to give you a lot of space and then you don't use it. We will let you grow into your web space there. Um, you get a domain name with your church website. You get, uh, and, and that's simply, that domain name that you get is simply the www churchwebsite.com there that's a domain name that comes with your church website you'll get what's called an easy content management system and this is the backend administrator that once we set up your website this is the the side that you will continue to use to maintain your church website and so once we design it we get it all set up we give you the site and then from there you take care of it and so after that you get also premium WordPress theme selections and these are some of the top quality themes having been a graphic web designer for over five years I have found some of the best themes and I have the the permissions to go ahead and use them on church websites and so you don't have to worry about uh, um, anything as far as uh, 
getting sued for any of these things I have the rights to them after we set up your site get a complete give it to you then we will give you a 30 minute walkthrough that will show you how to maintain your church website so whoever is going to maintain this should have a little bit of knowledge of computers and when I say that I'm not saying you need to know how to program or learn code what I'm saying is learn know how to use word or, or something along those lines it's not that hard to, to maintain your church website we also have a sermon plugin in case you want to host your sermons online that it, it will go with your with your website and it's great for visitors to hear messages from your church you also with this package will get one year of hosting and then you'll get five, a five page setup and what that details is just uh, simply uh, the basic home page an about page and that about page you provide the content for us it's about your church you get after that a doctrinal page and we have a doctrinal statement that we'll place in there and being independent Baptist I, I believe we all have a lot of the same beliefs here and so you'd feel comfortable with this doctrinal statement we have what you call a plan of salvation page for people to actually um, see the gospel written out there and then we have a contact page for people to actually go into your church website and if they have any questions or they want to get a hold of the church they can send an email and it'll go to whoever you want it to be sent to and those are the five pages that you get but also we do have what you call a blog integration where we integrate a blog into your church website so if a pastor has devotion they place online or if you want to put pictures from recent events or updates um, or if you want to go ahead and actually announce events for your church you can put them in your blog here and that that is at no extra cost as many pages as you want there um, that go inside of your blog posts and so that is what you get when you decide to use us designadvance.net for a church website and so let me say this uh, how much does it cost three hundred and ninety nine dollars which includes hosting and setup and you say why three hundred and ninety nine dollars well when we started our church I had the opportunity to 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 work a secular job it was just one of those things that comes with being a church planter and so when I started working I, I worked for a web design company and a website on this scale of what we're, what we're gonna offer you would normally cost the average business client two thousand dollars and that's quite a bit of money and I understand churches can afford that so I thought about it maybe going half price a thousand dollars and then I thought about it and I said well that's not really a ministry this isn't helping churches so I lowered it down to 500 and finally I said you know what um, we'll make it 399 it's it's enough profit for me as a church planter to, to make a, a living but it's also a tremendous discount for churches so that they can have a church website online that looks good so I understand where churches come from having started a church myself and this ministry is under the authority of our church Mountain View Baptist Church in Taos New Mexico you can look us up again my name is Esteban Montoya but this is what it is and this uh, is three hundred ninety nine dollars and this will help a church planter as he is uh, my family and I are starting our church from scratch but also it will help you as well so please consider that and so let me just uh, show you this one last slide here it's up to you let me ask you this question are you willing to take advantage of the internet and take control of your online presence once we help you set up your website we give the ball to you the balls in your court and you have the opportunity to take your um, ministry to the next level by having a church website so I hope that'll help you and further below there's a little form you can fill out and just go ahead and fill out all the information there and we'll go ahead and get a hold of you after you fill that out by email and then a call and we'll start asking some questions and help you get your church website online and our goal is to once you contact us to have something up within a week um, if not two weeks depending on how intense we need to design things but we want to help you make a church website so again this is Estevan Montoya with designadvanced.net thank you and have a great day